Welcome back. Our next comedian has been on this program a number of times, and he's back with us again tonight. He travels all over the country, as well as appearing on films and television shows. Please welcome back my friend, Tom Myers, ladies and gentlemen. What's up, man? All right. Yeah. All right, everybody, good to be here. Uh, I'm here in Montgomery County, of course, home of the speed camera. Yeah. My God. I actually love speed cameras. I do. Because it's a great way, because when an actual police officer pulls you over, it's a, it, what does the ticket cost? Like $150, $200? You get a, one of those little speed citations in the mail, 40 bucks. I love it. It's like getting pulled over by Sam's Club. <laughs> Not everybody shares the same sentiment that I do with uh, speed cameras. Like, a lot of friends think it's too much government overreach, and when they talk about government overreach, they always bring out the comparison of the, the Hitler. You know, oh, I tell you what, today it's speed cameras, tomorrow it's turning into Nazi Germany. Like, like I've watched a lot of documentaries on the History Channel. All the stuff I've seen about Hitler, nothing about speed cameras, all right? <laughs> And even if there were, small in comparison to everything else he did. You know, that's, I think we should give him credit. But uh, when I do drive, I like uh, listening to the radio a lot. Uh, one of my favorite things are uh, when radio stations go ahead and promote themselves. They try to do giveaways. Like, I was listening to this one radio station, and they said that if you listen to us, be the this caller at this time. We'll let you know when to call, and you could win a brand new Hummer and a $1,000 gas card. Really? I listen to your stupid station, the only thing you're going to give me is an ugly-looking vehicle and enough gas to fill about, oh, half the tank? I don't... I don't think so. I love filling up at gas pumps, though, because I learn a lot from just reading the stuff on gas pumps. For instance, uh, I learned that you're supposed to go ahead and turn off the engine before you go ahead and start filling up. You're not allowed to smoke near a gas pump. Yeah. I also learned that uh, Steve loves Jenny, so, <laughs> but I got a little bit confused because I also found out that Jenny is a slut, so, you know, maybe Steve's heart got broken, you know. Also, when I'm driving, listening to the radio, I like listening to uh, bluegrass music. I do. A lot of it's really good, but a lot of it just gets too hokey, like, it, it's, uh, the, the subjects are just absolutely basic, like, I was listening to this one bluegrass station, and this singer went on, and he went, Well, my wife ran off and left me, yee-haw, and my kids all ran away from home, woo-hoo-hoo, and my dog ran down to the creek and drowned himself, and I don't know why. Probably because you wouldn't give up your singing career there, goober. Ugh. <laughs> Uh, let the let the singers from Oh Brother Where Art Thou do their thing and uh, leave me in audio peace, okay? But uh, I actually do like that kind of music. What I like is uh, I've been in the airport in Nashville before, and the announcements that they do over the PA system, they actually have country and western singers, like renowned country and western singers, uh, record the audio drops for them. It's like, welcome to Nashville Airport, and if you see a suspicious package, please notify any security official. It's like, you hear that? Okay, it's charming, but, you know, if your flight's delayed, you have to listen to that for a few hours, it gets really uneasy, like you're supposed to hear them, like, like, like it's like the next thing they're going to say is, and if you're an Arab terrorist, get the hell out of this airport. <laughs> but, uh, no, I'm really, I'm really digging the band, Mimi Loco. You know, I love the, uh, I love the, the drummer over there. It uh, reminds me of uh, when I saw the film Deliverance, you know. That's, I, just expect, I just expect them to come up to me and go, uh, this road don't go to Aintree. <laughs> and I'm looking at the guy in, in the glasses. Uh, I, I think I'm actually going to read about him in the newspaper one day. <laughs> I am. And that newspaper article is going to include the sentence, before turning the gun on himself. I requested Freebird. They wouldn't play it. So, uh, <laughs> but uh, making a lot of uh, making a lot of changes in my life. I just uh, I just turned thirty, and you know you're getting older when you respond differently to uh, different junk email messages. Like uh, like I, I saw this like this one said naked photos of Kim Kardashian, and the next one said go to Europe for under five hundred dollars. The first thing that goes to my mind is whoa. 
Europe, less than $500. I got to check this out. No. Still picky about my still picky about my women though. I really am because uh, like the, like when they say, "Oh, there's that's a lot of beauty she has on the inside." Yeah, it's she's, she's beautiful on the inside. Like, yeah. She's uh, overstocked on the beauty, it looks like. Yeah. But my uh <clears throat> But my, my big thing is the, my girlfriend has to be has to be a non-smoker. Okay, I don't think women should smoke at all. I'll go ahead and finish this up, and then I'll get and then I'll be done. <laughs> I, it's not that I don't think women should smoke at all. It's not that I'm sexist. I just don't like the way it makes my laundry smell. Oh. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I don't like the, it's the cigarette ashes on the floor that I don't like because then it means I have to make her vacuum again. That's my time. I'm Tom Myers. Good night. <laughs> Those are some heavy hitters at the end there, Tom. <laughs> Emphasis on heavy. I'm heavy hitter. Heavy. <laughs> so, so you you tour all over the country. You're on Twitter, all that stuff. Tell everybody how they can find you and where, how they can see you live. Uh, you can find me on Twitter at Tom underscore Myers. Myers spelled M-Y-E-R-S. And you can find me online at Tom Myers dot U-S. Tom Myers dot U-S. He's about to get fucked up by the band, and we'll be right back. <laughs> <laughs>